I wanted to let you know that I know. You didn't blindly pick me out of the herd. The slow waves of Delta crashing against the shore had an undertow that pulls you into a slumber. <sighs> it's a beautiful thing. And I won't be selfish. I will help. Tuck them in. Watch them sleep. They too will find peace within the universe of the WoW. people when they talk because that's how conversations work what oh sorry i just can't stop thinking about what we've become it's clear that we're no longer human but then how can i feel like simon how can i feel like anything at all i mean technically i don't have any ears no mouth christ that's a weird thing to think about i mean i'm making sounds I'm still saying things. You sure are. <sighs> okay. Your new body most likely has senses similar to those you had as a human. And your mind, only knowing one way to perceive the world, superimposes that skill set on top of your new features. So my mind is covering it up, pretending nothing's different. If it didn't, you'd probably be incapable of interacting with the world at all. And the stress would either kill you or make you go insane. So I've found a good balance between awareness and ignorance. Does that mean I shouldn't think about this stuff, or are my thoughts actually making me cope? Could I tip the balance by suddenly gaining some insight and, and go insane? I wouldn't worry about it. I mean, we have real things to deal with. Saving mankind, remember? Speaking of which, we're closing in on Theta. I'll eject the Omni tool. As always, don't forget to take me with you. Uh, Kath, before you go, the artificial intelligence you mentioned in the escape vessel? Uh-huh, yeah, the warden unit, the WoW. Is it the WoW's fault that we're like this? I mean, it seems like something an unreliable AI would do. I suppose it set the ball in motion, but it's not directed with purpose. <laughs> it's really complicated to explain how machines think, Simon. Concentrate on getting inside data, okay? See you soon.